Welcome back guys to another weekend getaway. We are so excited to be back here in the Rockies and we are actually staying at the Fairmont Chateau Lake Louise. And we are really excited because the last time we were here was in December of 2019, so pre-pandemic and in the winter. So this is the first time that we've seen it in the summer and they actually blessed us with an awesome upgrade. So we actually get the Lakeview room. It's so blue right now, we are so excited to be out on the top floor for that matter too. And, um, but right now we are gonna enjoy the view for the next 10 minutes and then we are gonna be hitting up the pool. Off to the pool. So Alberta still has ongoing restrictions. So for us to get into the pool or the hot tub here, we actually had to book a time slot well in advance. Like this is a huge wait list just to come into this area. Yeah. We get about 45 minutes to just kick back and relax, soak in the hot tub, which we are kind of sweating in right now. Um, after this, we're gonna go grab some dinner by the lake. Hopefully catch a nice lake view again. Yes. And then after that, we will go to Moraine Lake for sunset. Hopefully the colors will be super epic. So we are now at the Fairview. This is actually the first time that we've dined here. Every time before, it would be pretty much all booked up so we can never get a reservation and we went straight for the lake view. So this time we get a different perspective and a beautiful dining room. We actually have the entire dining room section all to ourselves. The server is here just for us pretty much. And we are going to enjoy this dinner with the stunning view. We just finished dinner at the Fairview. The place was exquisite. Everything was really, really good. Only downside is that it's very, very expensive. So if you guys do want to check it out, you know, make sure you get your checkbooks ready because mm -hmm. uh, it's going to cost you a pretty penny. But right now we're just sort of hanging out here at Lake Louise because um, it was kind of weird because we've been here for a while, but this is the first time we've actually like came to the lake just on yeah. its own. We went straight to the room pretty much when we got here, went to the pool, went to dinner. This is the first time that we're actually outside. Exactly. So we're going to enjoy these views and then later we're going to head over to Moray. I think this is pretty much common knowledge now, but for those of you who haven't been to Moraine Lake, what you want to do is look for the rock pile. The signs quite literally almost everywhere. Follow the signs, head up onto the rocks, and that's how you get that picturesque Moraine Lake look for your photos, for video, whatever you guys want. At the base, you kind of see the lake, but it's nowhere near as amazing as what you would get if you just head up onto the rock pile. And that's where we're going right now. Okay, one thing I wanted to add about Moraine Lake is that it's actually the trailhead to a few popular and stunning hikes. We actually have Tower of Babel somewhere behind me, Larch Valley, which is where you'll see those beautiful bright orange larches in the fall, and a number of other hikes in the Valley of Ten Peaks.
morning guys it is currently about six o'clock in the morning we started our canoe ride at about 5 30. um there's only about i believe eight boats out here maybe six um for the little sunrise experience that's only available for the hotel guests so that is really awesome uh, we'll just enjoy our time out on the cyan waters the views are absolutely incredible this is actually our first time canoeing here on lake louise we're going to enjoy the rest of the day out here on the water for the next hour or so before we head back to the hotel and check out. such an amazing time on Lake Louise for sunrise. We're just gonna be taking a little bit of a break and grabbing some breakfast. Yes, staying here has been an absolute dream. Everything was perfect from the color of that water to the upgrade for the room. But stay tuned guys, because we are actually gonna head over to a different Fairmont. So we'll catch you guys at the next video. Bye.